Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my channel. Mr. Micah and I and Moni are back on Estancia La Pacha. Actually, you probably could join us, Moni, if you wanted to. You got the laptop to do it now. I don't want to join you. Fine. <laughs> okay, or not. <laughs> We've got our sprayer with herbicide. Um, we're, I'm going to have to start spraying this field because it's growing unevenly. It's growing all cattywombus. So we did lose our placeable fuel with the update to 1.3. Some people's placeables are disappearing. Mr. Mike, if you want to start tedding um, this field, and then I'll come behind you and windrow. It's still here. What's that? No, I just I just put it back. <laughs> oh, did you? Okay. Yeah. It was um, it was dead. So they did they up, upgrade the script then? Don't know how that worked, but I just put it back in and, and saved the game and tested it and came back in, and it was still there after I came back. So I'm assuming yes, but uh, if you so if you could Ted, there's a that case tractor right there, and the tedder's behind it, and then I'll windrow and then we'll collect it. Also need to weed that field. Wait a minute, you want me to Ted with that big tractor? Yeah, I mean, why not? That's what it's. We were running it. We might as well use it, right? Might as well. Now we don't get charged when we're not using it, right? Only when we're running it. Um, I think that's correct. I think the hours that you put on it are what you get charged for. But we need to have this guy spray those crops. So I need to put this over here. Gosh, it's been a while. Yeah, I know. <laughs> so I, obviously you've upgraded to the late, the latest one. Um, what do you think? Of what? The new patch. Oh, this is my first time playing it since the last time we played. I really like the fact that... Um, you now, when you're when you have material in whatever you're carrying, which you, you're not seeing right now, they actually give you the name of what you're carrying and the percentage of how much is left. Mm -hmm. So you're no longer just guessing what's in there. Like right now, there's no there's a symbol, but it also says herbicide. And uh, I think that's pretty cool that they did that. Um, that's one of the new things with the new the new patch that I'm liking. So how weird how these weeds grew in here. Well, it's because we planted grass. <clears throat> well, no, I'm saying over here, too, on the field, though, the weeds are coming in, like, very unevenly. And it's making me crazy. Mm -hmm. So how are things in Toledo? Any exciting news or fun events or? Uh, no one got killed this weekend, so that's good. That's good. <laughs> That's a plus, yeah. That's a good no, thing. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Things are going okay. Yeah. Did you see the new uh, E Flight release there, uh, F 15 Strike Eagle? Mm -mm. I guess it's made by a different manufacturer, somebody that I, I have airplanes from called FMS. Watch your mouth. I know. Well, they there it stands for Famous FMS. It's really funny. Uh, and they're uh, they they make World War II and and fighter jets, and uh, they're rebranding it as an E flight package and putting their own electronics in it and stuff. But it's a really cool like sixty five millimeter um, EDF jet, hmm. and it looks really really good. It looks like a real F fifteen, and it does the high alpha, so you can like pull. The, it's got a computer system in it that stabilizes it, so you can like pull the nose back, and it'll do like like where it floats slowly. Like how you see the the Blue Angels do stuff like that. It's really cool. Oh, it's got cruise control. But, <laughs> no, you still have to control it, but... <laughs> oh, well, you still have to steer a car. Yeah, well, that's true. <laughs> I never looked at it like that, but I suppose you're right. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just trying to get these weeds off this field uh, as much as I can before they go to the second stage. Though I suppose it doesn't matter with this because with the spray... It kills them once they're adults anyway. Yeah, it kills them anytime, so I guess there's no rush, but that's the benefit of the of the spray is you can just wait till it's almost full grown, then spray and then you're done. Yeah, because when the flowers pop it's easy to see them. Mm-hmm. 
when they haven't popped, it's not so easy. Um, so I've got some interesting news. Um, our church is looking for a music director or like a worship arts director to work. No way. You guys got Sting? <laughs> you what? Mean Gordon? You mean Gordon Sumner? Yeah. <laughs> Don't stand so. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna apply for it. Really? And I've been told is it a by job, job or is it? Yeah, a... like it's a full time job. Sweet. Um. Yeah. I mean, yes and no. I. I it means I'm gonna have to kind of balance different things out in my life a little differently. But I think that you know, I think it, especially with you know with Simone and I getting married this coming year and having to provide for her kids along with my kids. Uh, I think I need the health care and stuff, you know? We need a guaranteed income. Yeah, and guaranteed income, too. And so if... Because, unfortunately, with your job, like, it's proven this year, it's not guaranteed. Yeah, it's been so bad, Micah. It's been so bad. Like, I've got nothing right now. It's horrible. I've, I literally have no money to pay my bills. And that it happens every year this time. Do you know spring? what? Spring? Yeah, every spring. It just, stuff just slows. Right right now, now that the weather's getting ba- better, it's starting to pick up a little bit, but it's really, not. It's, it's not enough. Yeah, it's not. Well, I did hear the housing. Uh, we'll say that again, Micah. You broke up. I did hear the housing is getting, is pretty bad. But yeah, it's bad. We and just it, got a house that went for sale in our neighborhood. I mean, it went up for, it's 180000 and it and it's just two bedroom house, and and it just went up. And it, a lady wants to buy it right away, so I don't know. What's happening is there's, and that's that's what's hurting us. People aren't selling because they're not gonna they're gonna get worse rates on their in, like on their uh, interest rates. So people aren't wanting to sell because there's no. You're, why would you move to a house that's gonna cost you more? You know, you're getting less mm-hmm. for your money. So people just aren't selling. So what's happening is the houses there's less houses on the market. Which makes it so that they sell immediately when they come on the market. And that's been happening right. for almost a year. Um, and it makes my business go way down because the realtors, honestly, they don't have to really do any marketing anymore. They put the house up and it sells because there's no other houses on the market. So it's, it's now if that, you know, that, that will change over the next couple of years, but for right now. So when it's good for some, it's bad for others. Right. It's killing me. It's really been a hard. This last year, the whole year was bad. Um, I made. Less than now, thankfully, with with the farm sim release and stuff, I made the same amount of money that I did last year. But as far as my business goes, I was down probably 20 percent. So and that's with a bunch of new clients and stuff. So it's just it's we're going to have to do something different. So I don't know if it'll work out or not. I hope it does. uh, But I can only try, you know. Mm hmm. So. But it's a good opportunity. Yeah, but if you get a job at the church, man, then that's all the flying you can do whenever you want. Because <laughs> of the parking lot? Yeah. You'll be there when it's empty, you know? And... Yeah, it's true. At lunchtime. There you go. go out and fly lunchtime, my airplanes at lunch. Flying a plane. <laughs> what do you think about that, Moo? No, no response? She's just shaking her head no. <laughs> Not like no, like you can't do that, but no, like, oh. What, we what, boys got to play. That's right. <laughs> I've told him if he gets me a RC unicorn, I'll be quite happy. A flying RC unicorn? What's up, Rye? Uh, Mike and I are farming, and Moni's watching and playing on her phone. Uh, we're recording and farming. No stream, though. Stream tomorrow. So, can you straighten up Ryan downstairs? Like shoes away, coats away, vacuum, please. Come on, I did the dishes this morning. And I straightened up. <laughs> he totally jumped. <laughs> I made like I was going to smack him. And I took the dog to the pound, to, not to the pound, but to the SPCA. <laughs> to the pound, yeah. Really. Yeah, see you later, dog. Good luck. <laughs> Yeah, we no. killed the dog and ate it for dinner. <laughs> That's what Ryan said. Did you take her to a Korean place or? <laughs> to a Korean. <laughs> Love Ryan. Uh, yeah. That is kind of a weird looking guitar. It's 
it's so it's so unique. So it's ugly. Ugh. Dude, if I, I think it would be really comfortable to hold. It's super weird, like, but it looks pretty comfortable. It like, looks. All the co- I, really I like it with the wood grain. It looks a lot better. I don't like the white. They're so expensive. <gasps> no, 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 no! Don't sell. What? what you do? Repair. I do that all the time, Micah. They're about two point five k for one of them. Yeah, I know. It was like I I hit a like a confirm like everything repair, and then also I seen this for sale. Like, ooh, don't do that. <clears throat> right, right. There you go. Yeah, you'll have to get the job first. <laughs> Are we mowing any other spots? This is just it, right? Nope, this is it. And just we're just collecting this and putting it into our inventory. So Ryan is going to get an eight-string guitar once he gets his job. I'll have to get a guitar, too. Why? I don't have an acoustic that has a plug-in. Oh, so you're going to get rid of something to get that? Yeah, probably. I'll probably sell a couple electrics. Are we bailing or are we just... Uh, <laughs> um, No, this? we're going to use that collection wagon and then put it in the hayloft. Okay. Yep, no more. We don't... I mean, we... Since we don't have cows, we don't really... Need to bail. Yeah, we don't really need okay. to bail to make silage, so... No. Horses high. Pardon my French. <laughs> Ooh la la. Why are you touching me? <laughs> what are you doing? What's that, Rye? Really? Yeah, I was, I, was, I was up there. So usually they have like, you know, like a 65, 5 plus or something up there. You know, they just must be low on stock. But I'm mean, like new. They don't have any high gain, new high gain amps. Weird. Mine is like the lunchbox 5150s that sound terrible. Well, what about, what about line 6? Well, line 6 doesn't have tube stuff. It's all solid state. I mean. No, they do too. Yeah, but they have like, it's like they're modeling tube amps and they sound awful. <laughs> they don't have them there because those things are like four grand a piece. Yeah, some of them are not great. I, I have to agree with that. Thing tube amps are not good for is modeling amps. Right, because you actually want you for if you're going to use a modeling amp, you actually want to have an amplifier that does not flavor the sound. Yeah, because the point of a modeling amp. Ooh, flavorless sound. Like the tube amps. Yuck. Yuck. No, you have to. Well, like yeah, but that Fender amp that I have sounds pretty good. Yeah, but yeah, but it's not. It's modeled after Fender amps though. It's not yeah. Modeled after other amps. I'm True. Right. But it's a modeling amp, so it only has those specific amp sounds like the 5150 copy and the right. 5505 and Mesa Dual Rectifier copy, Marshall copy, but they sound awful. They sound only slightly better than the Line 6 solid state stuff. Right. The guitar center doesn't even have any of those up there, which is surprising. They just have like the crappy small Line 6 and Fender DB. Why are you turning your camera off, Moni? No. She just got to pick her nose. No, that's not what she's doing. She's going to smoke. No. All right. Oh, I just crashed. Oops. What's up, Rye? Not much. How you doing, kiddo? You're just a what? Why? Why are you sad, Rue? Dude, I'm just I'm telling you, just get a just get a job with like start get in your car, drive up and down the strip and just go to game, you know, anywhere that you see that has help wanted signs. There's tons of them in Medina. You can get a job somewhere. No, you, no you, Ryan, just go look for a job. You need to get experience. 
Dude, you can move in with Nate. He's moving into Akron somehow. Ugh. I'm not living in Akron. Akron's got a good amount of jobs, but I'm not living in Akron. Yeah, moving in with Nate sounds fun. So it sucks in Akron. The drivers are awful and the roads are even worse. I'm just saying, like, if you you could find a job somewhere, right? There's got to be work somewhere. That's and you could save up money and then... I've already applied to all the easiest places. All right, well, you haven't applied to McDonald's yet. I'll do Taco Bell instead. Taco. I always try uh, the best, Bell. some of the best jobs is the uh, picking up trash. Those guys make tons of money. Yeah. Get on the job. I mean, get on the classifieds on the post. Did you almost say go to Craigslist? No. You can go to Craigslist, too, no. but. <laughs> I'm not getting raped. <laughs> That's Craigslist is not. Yeah, problem. you could get mugged. That's the other issue with Craigslist, right? Yeah. Uh, no. Like I said, I've already applied to all the, the easy jobs here, and none of them ever get back to uh, me. Ever. Well. I don't know. What do you think, Mr. Micah? So many times About what? I sent, I sent a guitar. I mean, I sent the application to the guitar center probably fifteen times. Uh, they're not hiring apparently. McDonald's twice, Burger King three times, and both the Taco Bells on 18 and in town, and never heard back. Or they're like, "Oh, we'll call you in a few days." You know. You know, you could always if he doesn't know what he likes, to, you could always I try applied in like two months. applying at a temp agency. You could always do a temp agency. A temp agency. There's Minutemen staffing. You know, and then you could try different jobs, see what he likes. If you do Minutemen, they they'll find you work. Right. Yeah, well. Well, maybe then start working to get your CDL. I'm going to mow up here, Mr. Micah, to get these weeds down. Well, you won't have to do that because they fixed the uh, the grass textures now. Cool. So once we redo the grass textures. Oh, so I shouldn't have mowed this is what you're saying? No. It's, Oops. You don't have to. Ah, let's just do just, it. We can just redo the uh, texturing, and it'll come out with grass, regular okay. grass. I'm hoping. I'm hoping that when we plow over, it won't plow anymore. We have to test it to find out. Because right now, I'm mowing it. Well, we could always use a little grass. So, so I think we're going to axe the Michigan map. What? Uh, we lost all animal pens on the Michigan map. Oh, because of the update? Because of the patch, yeah. Why not just wait for the patch, the, the guy who made it, to repatch it? I don't know that that's going to be fixed. Oh, why, did the guy who made the map die or something? No, I don't know. I think we're going to have... <laughs> I think we'd have to start over again. Oh, okay. <laughs> like, I don't think... I think once they're gone, they're gone. You know what I mean? Okay. I don't know though. Maybe not. What do you is that? Do you think that's going to get uh -huh. fixed? You know, how to I don't know. You can always cheat them back in, can't you? Just give yourself some extra money and go buy the pens, put them back where they were at, and I suppose so. I don't. You know, to be honest with you, I don't love the map. <laughs> then what are you doing? I just want to get rid what of it. What's going on that map then? I know. Because <laughs> some of the guys that are playing on the map, they want to stay. <laughs> Wait! Don't run yeah. over the crops. No. <laughs> Huh? It's okay. First stage growth doesn't die when you run it over. So. Right. I knew that. <laughs> he said, "I knew that. I know it." This tractor has gotten to the bottom of the repair thing. That's not. I, don't, I haven't seen it get really any lower. Man, I tell you, I wish somebody would remake those out of that one mountain pass map. Oh, that huge one where you have to make your own fields and stuff? Remember the one where we had to go up into the mountains? That would be a good starting for scratch, starting from scratch map. Oh, I know. I know. It's just it. It's like the 17 map that should have came out for 19. 
I just feel bad because it seems like the map maker mod, like the mod makers, are just bailing altogether. Doesn't it? Seems like they're all kind of just like n not caring and not wanting to do it anymore. I think they're just all going private. I mean, wouldn't that? Like I I I uh, joined a Facebook page that they make a bunch of mods. Yeah. And they're always showing the mods they're making, and they're really cool. But there's no place to really go download them that I can find. It's always weird. Like it's it's very hard to get to the. Yeah, and see, to me, that's, like, silly. Like, if I was going to spend all this time making a cool map, I'd want everybody on Earth playing it. Wouldn't you? No, some people are really selfish. I just, it's weird. Like, hey, I want to make this awesome. what I have, but awesome... you can't have it. Yeah, I guess that's the idea. It's really what, it's really what it boils down to, because it's, like, for me, at least, I'd be like, I want everybody to, to have this map, and it's going to be fun, and it's cool, and, you know, it's like, and then you see it on YouTube. People are playing on my map. That's cool. You know, it's like I get notoriety because people are playing my map. And then some guy takes the map and, and then steals it. Yeah, and it changes and the name and makes it his. his name on it. And you're seeing yeah. your map with some guy's name on it. And they're all praising that one guy and not you. <laughs> yeah, that's true. And that is what's happened. But And that's exactly what happened to the mod map makers. Yeah. Look, remember Stevie's map, that one we really liked we never did finish? Uh, um, Snetterton? Yeah. Yep, that was a great map. Such a great map. I hate the name. Terrible name. Snetterton? Well. Is that what it's... well. <laughs> he said, well. <laughs> Don't offend Stevie. Keep that stuff to yourself. Terrible name, Stevie. Change it. <laughs> Snetterton. Might as well call it Snotterton. <laughs> what if that's his grandfather's name? Oh! You just insulted him. Ouch. Yeah. Sorry, Grandpa Snetterton. Well, with ton at the end, it would be a town, so it's Snedder Ton, Snedder Town. I'm just now, how did up. I miss that bit of grass? That's not right. Well, if it's grass and not straw or hay, um, sorry, not straw, hay, then it's missable. Well, I ran through the whole thing with the uh, grass flipper flopper tatter thingy. <laughs> the grass flip flopper? Oh, it's picking it up. I'll just pick it up. There we go. It's all gone. All gone. Next time we'll use that tractor to mow and Ted at the same time, because that makes more sense. <laughs> and we'll use this one to do the wind rowing behind it. <gasps> Whoa. Nose up. We need to make some money. Make my money. Yeah, I know. Um, that's like real life. I need to make some money. Oh, well. So are you going to need some choir boys? <laughs> what kind of weird question was that? I wouldn't mind volunteering to be a choir boy in your church. No. Oh, my God. Hang on. Just wait down there. Um, I'm going to, like, before you turn around, hang on. Hold on. Whoa, wait. Ooh, wait ooh. I was going on the outside edge. Okay. No. Oh yeah, that's fine. Do well now. Just wait. In fact, I'm gonna. I can even probably combine these and make them one. Nah, I won't be able to do that. It's not wide enough. Go ahead and grab that row, and I'll get the top row while you're doing that. Just get out of my way. Get out of my way. Are you getting sleepy, Babs? Oh. Why is she getting sleepy? It's not even. Yes, it is. Time there yet, is it? Uh, it's. Was it five? Almost five o'clock on or six? Almost six. And she's jet lagged terribly. <laughs> oh yeah. You fall asleep, Babs. She looks like she's about to fall asleep. <laughs> so make sure you put the cigarette out first. Oh. No, she's oh. not. She's she's not smoking. What did she? Oh, don't. She didn't hear that, did she? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> he said what? <laughs> no, I've been teasing her. She's she's quitting today. She didn't smoke while she was here the whole time. But she had a stressful trip home, and so she smoked. I tell you what, the first time I quit, it was easy. Second time, oh my gosh. Really? What a battle. Yeah. Why? It was so hard. I don't know. I wonder why I that is. <clears throat> it seems like it would be just the same, you know? Now, do they take hay in here? In where? I was just getting some. This spot here. Uh, yes. Yep. 
Yes, they do. All right, we finished wind rowing. And I'm going to back in here. Okay, filled them up. Nice. Excuse me. Burp. Whoa, how do we lose 30 how do we lose $5,000? I have no idea. Oh, that could have been least. Because I'm using this because I'm using this tractor. That could be the lease. Let me take a look. It doesn't it probably won't tell me right away though, will it? Could have been the loan. Well, it's ten o'clock in the afternoon. <sighs> Vehicle leasing costs uh twenty three thousand dollars yesterday, eleven thousand dollars today. Yeah, I told you. Should have been using it. Well what do we do? We're not gonna have enough money for the, that tractor to buy it yet. Well, no. <laughs> well, no. Want me to wash it off? I'll wash it. You can wash it. I'm going to repair the trailer and then put... Quick, shut it off. It's costing us money. That's yeah. probably like 20 bucks right there, just letting it idle. Just right. No, I don't think it goes by that. I think it goes by the time that you're actually sitting in the tractor. That's how they used to measure it, which is probably what they're doing. Do you want to fix up our Strautman? I did. Ah. I did repair it. Good job. Let's pop that there. <coughs> Pardon me. You can sh shove that thing away. We got, uh, I think we got nothing in there. Yep. Nice backing job, Mr. Micah. Been a while. Very professional. All right, so I suppose at this point, wait, what needs lime? Just this area, right? Oh, this whole field needs lime. Whoa. Well, let's put that down. Uh, I'll grab the little tractor. Do we have a limer or no? No. I'm just going to rent a small one. Actually, we'll probably just buy it. You know what? It's probably cheaper just to buy one. Yeah, just buy it. We only got no money. <laughs> <laughs> We can't even afford to even keep the tractor we're renting. That's right. <laughs> you want to go buy stuff. No, we'll be able to do it. It'll be sweet. <laughs> we'll be fine. Yeah, you say that now. Let's see where we're at. Can you find out how many horsepower is required to pull our planter? 180 because we're getting rid of that planter. No, the or big one? The planter? Yeah. I, th I think it's the uh, big twack, though. It's the Vader stat, but I'm wondering I'm wondering what the what the horsepower is on that, what it requires. Do you see a requirement on there? Sorry, I was just the Vader stuff. The big one, yeah. It's our it's our big cedar for the cotton fields. Oh, the cedar, not the planter. Well, it's a planter. The planters are what plant cotton and corn and stuff like that. They they plant the rows. Well, there's an Amazon. There's a Optima. Uh, hold on. Uh, I'll check it. Uh, it's going to be garage. Tempo. The horse. It's the... I thought it was Vader, the Vader stand. Oh, the Va oh, yeah, the Vader stand. 300. That's why we have the... Ah, okay. Yeah, that's a pretty big discrepancy, so we'll have to keep that, I guess. Now, we don't own the, the Tempo either, do we? And that as well. <sighs> no, we own it. 
Do we? Okay. We we don't we the only things we don't own are the disco loader, or the disco lander and the optima. And then the bail spike and the uh, the um, for feeding the the horses the bales the straw bales. Um, we don't own those. But we're gonna get rid of that once those bales are gone anyway, because we don't. That's cheap per day. It's really nominal. Shoot, we don't have it because it's a mod. So I'm gonna have to. We're gonna have to rent one of these. We don't have what. Uh, we want, we'll set up narrow. So we're going to lease this. We don't have a lime, a lime, or we'll have to lease one. And we'll just get lime from the lime station. Okay. How are the horses doing? Dang. They still don't need to be ridden. <laughs> when was the, are the, do we have two new horses from today or should we buy two more? Where are you getting all this money? <laughs> well, we got, I mean, we're going to have $150,000 from cotton coming in at the end of the harvest. Which still is enough to buy a tractor. No, I know. We'll have to continue, le we'll have to continue leasing. Plus all this lime I'm about to buy. Arthur, oh, are you yeah, Gibson, you're going to fit there. Sure. Wait, what'd you say, Micah? I said, Arthur, you silly boy. I know. I know, but we got to do what we got to do. But we're down another 3,000. Oh, that was the lease. Okay. <laughs> I really feel like we need the small Voltra. Gosh. <laughs> I mean, we could always take, we could always return our lease, our leases. If you, want to, if you want to return the disco lander and the all that stuff, but actually, you could return it because we're going to have a sprayer and a a seeder that plants uh, uh, with fertilizer at the same time. Just to get the case, it's two hundred and fifty-two thousand. Just to buy it so we don't have to pay rent. <clears throat> yeah, but the rent's not that bad. I mean, we're paying 20000 a day. So in like four days, we could buy one easily. <laughs> I don't know. It's still, it's still way less than... Do you know what I'm saying? Like eventually we'll buy one. How... I don't think this is rent to own. No, it's not. So whatever you spend on rent with this vehicle it's gone. is money you've wasted. Yeah, you're right. We still have to come up with the 200 something to buy. <laughs> right. Right. So by spending twenty five grand a day on a tractor, that you know, that's why this equipment is just we shouldn't have got that too much of a. Well, do you want to get rid of it then? We can try to pull the cedar with the Stara. Like, what do you think? If we get the truck behind the cedar, the Stara. Could probably could do it. <laughs> oh my gosh! Can we use the combine to pull it? No. <laughs> well, is there are there any like under two hundred and fifty thousand dollar tractors that we can buy? Big, we could get a big bud. Ah, but see, big bud doesn't have the adapter. Uh, yeah, it does actually. Big bud works with that cedar. Arthur, are you crazy? Arthur. Yes. Simone can answer that for you. Am I crazy, honey? I'm refusing to answer it. Oh, she's refusing. Because oh. the answer is yes. Indubitably. Psycho. Now, I don't know. This is stuck. Even if we just try to get a Puma with 270 horsepower, it's still 210. Uh, but leasing is ten thousand. I think that's what we have, isn't it? Or we have a Magnum. We have an Optima. I mean, see what the leasing is on the Optima. What's our actual cost on the Optima? 
Oh, and by the way, ladies and gentlemen, we'll continue this discussion in the next episode. Have a great night. Be no sure to subscribe. Way. Thumbs up always what? help. And we'll see you on the next exciting episode.